Light, it's everywhere. It's how we see the world, the stars, and even the edges of our universe. But what if I told you that the speed of light, 299,792 kilometers per second, isn't just a mind-blowing fact, but a key to understanding the very fabric of reality? Imagine circling Earth 7.5 times in a single second. That's how fast light travels. But why is it so fast? And why is this speed constant across the universe? Let's embark on a journey to unravel the mysteries of light's incredible speed. When we talk about the speed of light, we're not just throwing out a big number. It's the ultimate speed limit of the universe. 299,792 kilometers per second, or about 1 billion kilometers per hour. Let's put that into perspective. The fastest jet on Earth, the SR-71 Blackbird, reaches speeds of around 3,500 kilometers per hour. Even that marvel of engineering is no match for light's incredible pace. You've likely experienced the speed difference yourself during a thunderstorm. You see the lightning first, but the thunder takes seconds to follow. Light is so fast that in the blink of an eye, it can travel distances we can barely fathom. One of the strangest and most revolutionary discoveries in physics is that the speed of light is constant. Regardless of whether you're standing still, driving at 100 km per hour, or traveling in a spaceship, light will always move at the same speed in a vacuum. This principle was a cornerstone of Einstein's theory of relativity. It means that space and time themselves adjust to ensure light always maintains its speed. In a way, the universe bends its own rules to preserve this cosmic constant. To understand why light moves so quickly, we need to look at what determines its speed. Light is an electromagnetic wave, meaning it's made up of oscillating electric and magnetic fields. The speed of light is dictated by two fundamental properties of the vacuum, electric permittivity and magnetic permeability. These are like the universe's built-in settings for how electric and magnetic fields behave. Think of it this way. The vacuum of space acts like a perfectly calibrated medium for light to travel through. It's the ultimate highway, free of resistance, allowing light to achieve its maximum speed. So why is light so fast? The answer lies in the nature of photons, the tiny particles of light. Photons have no mass, meaning they aren't slowed down by inertia. Unlike a rocket or even a subatomic particle, photons don't need to accelerate to reach their speed. They start at the universe's speed limit and stay there. But why exactly 299,792 kilometers per second and not a different value. That's a deeper question tied to the fundamental properties of the universe. If the speed of light were slower, the entire structure of reality would change. Stars might not shine, planets wouldn't form, and life as we know it could be impossible. Additionally, some physicists have speculated that the speed of light might have evolved over cosmic history. In the early universe, fundamental constants could have shifted, influencing the behavior of light. While this remains unproven, it opens up fascinating possibilities about the interplay between light and the cosmos. Additionally, some physicists have speculated that the speed of light might have evolved over cosmic history. In the early universe, fundamental constants could have shifted, influencing the behavior of light. While this remains unproven, it opens up fascinating possibilities about the interplay between light and the cosmos. Scene, a telescope capturing light from distant galaxies. The speed of light isn't just a number. It's a key that unlocks the universe's secrets. When we observe galaxies billions of light years away, we're looking back in time. The light we see today left those galaxies long before Earth even existed. Even here in our own solar system, the speed of light has practical implications. Messages sent from Mars can take up to 20 minutes to reach Earth, meaning astronauts will experience delays in communication. 
The speed of light isn't just a scientific curiosity, it's a cornerstone of our understanding of the universe. Its value is deeply intertwined with the very laws that govern reality, from how galaxies form to how time flows. But let's think about what this means for us as explorers of the cosmos. Light carries information about the origins of stars, the formation of planets, and the history of the universe itself. Every beam of light that reaches our eyes has traveled vast distances and immense timescales, bringing with it a story of the cosmos. Consider this, the light we see from the sun took about eight minutes to reach us. That means every sunrise is a view into the sun's recent past. The light from distant stars? That could be millions or even billions of years old. When we look at the night sky, we are witnessing a cosmic time machine in action. But it's not just about looking outward. The speed of light also defines the limits of what we can achieve technologically. From the internet to interstellar communication, light speed is both a tool and a boundary. As we develop new ways to harness light, lasers, fiber optics, even solar sails, we continue to push the boundaries of what's possible. Throughout history, the speed of light has fascinated and challenged the greatest minds, from Newton to Einstein. It has reshaped our understanding of space, time, and even causality itself. What's incredible is that despite all we know, light still holds mysteries waiting to be uncovered. Could its speed vary in extreme conditions? Could it reveal deeper truths about the universe? The speed of light reminds us of the beauty and complexity of the universe. It connects us to the cosmos in profound ways, showing us not just where we are, but how far we've come in our understanding. As we continue to study and explore, light will guide us, both literally and metaphorically, toward new frontiers. Thanks for joining this journey through the mysteries of light. If you enjoyed this deep dive, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more cosmic explorations. What questions about the universe fascinate you the most? Let us know in the comments below.